Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. Fallfinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on what is DSL. You hear the term all the time. Do you have DSL? The phone company asks, would you like DSL? DSL simply stands for Digital Subscriber Line. And what it is is a way to transmit data over a regular phone line. Bear in mind that I am not a graphic artist and I did the best that I could. Just to give you an idea of how DSL differs from dial-up. Dial-up essentially equals analog. So here you have your computer it's connected to the phone. And that would go into a modem. Modem stands for modulate, demodulate. So it would take analog data, convert it to digital, send it out through the phone lines that were carrying data and voice to the internet. Now those of you who remembered using dial-up, you had an outside call come in, it would break off your connection to the internet because the phone line took precedence. In DSL, it's digital. So the computer connects to the phone line that connects to a DSL modem that has filters in place because voice and data are at different frequencies. So to look at it this way, your data connection is on the same line as your phone, but it's traveling at different frequencies. So the data goes out to the internet, goes back and forth, and your voice can go back and forth at the same time. So in this way, with DSL, you can talk on the phone and use the phone on the internet at the same time. And that's because the phone lines are capable, they have the bandwidth to carry both voice and data, but in the past, they didn't have the filters and the necessary equipment to make it possible. So now, with a digital dedicated service line, you can talk on your phone while you're transmitting data, and the data can be transmitted much faster because it's already digital. So that's DSL, and that's all there is to it.